Hi, here's a brief guide on how to use an amazing application called A Power Rec. To use this app, you must download it first from its official page. Once installed, open the program and set some preferences by going to settings. From here you are given two options, to set the basic settings, or to adjust the advanced settings. The program's main panel is consist of five major functions represented by these buttons. The system sound, microphone, webcam, recording modes, and the record button. All four buttons are clickable which you can easily activate and disable. If you need to record the system sound, the microphone, the webcam and screen at the same time, simply enable all four buttons. In case you need to record audio only, simply choose the audio that you prefer either system sound or microphone, disable the webcam and screen recording and then click record. After doing some settings you can now proceed with the recording. To start a recording all you need to do is to set the recording mode that you want and then click the record button to initiate the recording. The recording will then start after the count of three. If you activated the webcam button, you can freely move the camera feeds anywhere you want it to be placed. To hide the toolbar, simply drag it on the edge of your screen, and hover your mouse back to relaunch the toolbar. While recording, you can also add annotations as you wish. D03. Mm -hmm. Once you're done, just hit the stop button and the recorded file will pop up inside the tools recording list. Other functions that you can use in this program includes a task scheduler function that gives you an opportunity to record something even if you're not around. To use this, go to Task and click New Task. A new window will appear, from here you can set the start time, duration, recording area, and other settings that you need for your scheduled recording. Click OK when everything is set, and a countdown timer will be displayed on the bottom right portion of the tool. Filled with hatred! Weak, just like your Captain Tre and full. Next is the follow recording function that allows you to automatically end a recording by simply closing the program that you follow. To do this, go to Task Menu and select Follow Recording. Another window will then appear, tick the box to enable this function. Now from the follow the application menu, a list of running applications will be shown under the drop down menu. Next is to choose the program to follow, as well as the recording area, audio input, and web camera. Now click OK to finalize the settings that you've made. To end the recording all you need to do is to close the application that you are following and the captured clip will be saved automatically under the tools recording list. With this program you can also upload video to YouTube directly using the tools upload function. Choose a video to upload and then fill up the details that you want for your video and then click upload. Wait for a moment till your video is uploaded on YouTube successfully. In case you need to take a screenshot, you can do it by accessing the built-in screenshot function under the Tools menu. To take a screenshot drag the crosshair along the area that you need to capture and release it. A preview will then be shown, 
Now you can save the screenshot right away or you can add annotations if you wish. Another way to capture a screenshot is by utilizing the screen capture button located at the toolbar. Hit the screen capture function and the snapshot will be saved under the tools screenshot library. And that's a brief guide on how to use a power rec. Thank you for watching.